What is going on with you, YouTube? This is Dave from Tech Refresh coming at you with another video. Today, we are reviewing the Rinky Fusion clear case for the iPhone 15 Pro Max. Now, you could find this case on Amazon. Let's take a look. Four and a half stars, so people like it. It is a crystal clear case for the most part, and it's for the low. It's for the cheap. $12.99. Link will be in the description. If you like clear cases, this is probably the way to go. Now, all the reasons why I don't like this case are personal preference. Um, and the main, main reason why this is not my favorite case is Rinky sent me five cases. All the other four cases uh, just offer more. Just clear cut, plain and simple. The other cases that I have from Rinky um, just add things that this one does not do. Now, let's snap it in and do a tour of the case. Now, let me just say this. I'm a little biased when it comes to clear cases. I do not like clear cases on dark phones. I think they look better on the light colored phones. So that's already my own personal preference strike. But let's do the tour at the bottom. Perfect. You know, Rinky doesn't miss with the fit. You have the lanyard. And on the sides, it's not clear. It's not like a crystal clear. It does have a little pattern that I can see. Um, but it's very, it's hardly noticeable, but one strike against this case. And this is just the nature of a clear case that you want to be perfectly clear. No grip, right? All the other cases I have offer grip. This doesn't offer any special feeling for grip. So that's kind of a strike against it in my book. Um, the buttons are just okay. They're not the most tactile greatest buttons on this case. I have Uh top clear, of course. Other side, the action button is probably the worst of them all. Just not a lot of give. Doesn't push that great. Yeah, it's just it's just not a great feeling button. Volume rockers up and down are fine, but they still don't have the most give. And then you have a second lanyard spot um, on the side. And, of course, no grip. Let's take a look at the protection. This is a very thin case. Um, so that's one thing I love about it. You're getting protection and you're not getting bulk. How could you lose? As you can see, it raises a little bit more up at the top and down at the bottom. All right, let's come along the back where we're striking out a little bit more. Um, first, the camera's open, which is my preferred method. The cover camera is growing on me, but I still prefer it open. Uh, it does come above the lenses, so you're just fine. Uh, a little boring on the back, but it's supposed to be. Now, this is a smudge fingerprint magnet. There's no way to avoid it. I, you can't even really give it a strike. It's just... It's just what it is, but I have a personal preference strike. I'm getting to the point where I, I need MagSafe. Like I'm getting tired of taking my cases off at night to use it, my phone as a dock. So MagSafe is almost like, it's a must in my opinion. So buttons aren't that great. No MagSafe, no grip. It's still a good clear case. It just, I would prefer a not clear case that offers a little more like a kickstand, some grip, something um, other than just the case. And that's why it's $12.99 and people want a clear case for phones. They want to show off their phones. I get it. Kind of closest thing you're going to get to rocking it naked. So I get the clear case thing, but it's just not my jam. All right, man. Rinky, you're four out of five. It's not my favorite case, but the other four were all amazing in my opinion. All right. Stay tuned for more iPhone 15 Pro Max case reviews. Uh, get active in the comments. I'll hit you guys up another time. Peace.